if you are here and you are not in a relationship, get in one. <laughs> tonight, look around, just choose someone. It's phenomenal. If you are here tonight and you are already in a relationship, get in another one. <laughs> Collect the whole set. And I'm pretty sure no parent wants to turn around to see their crying infant being held aloft by a stranger. So she politely asked me what was going on. I said, oh, sorry, lady, I just need your daughter. It's cool. <laughs> Some of you are ahead of me on this one because she started screaming at me to put the girl down. I have no idea what's going on. Then, of course, I realized I just told this mother that I need her daughter. Hey, lady, I just need your daughter. It's a goddamn homophone, which, FYI, also not a good thing to be yelling out in public because it makes you sound like an illiterate gay bash, a goddamn homophone. Anyway. Look how long have you guys been together? Well, we actually just got married. You just got married last week! Holy shit! A round of applause to that! There you go, yeah, and this is the cheapest honeymoon you could possibly have. Where are we gonna go? I don't know, downtown Auckland? Because a wedding is the single most arrogant thing you can do. And society just accepts it. And encourages it. It's phenomenal. It's the most arrogant thing I've ever seen in the world. All a wedding is, all a wedding is, is getting all of your friends and family together. Hey, everybody. You're all so important to me. I want you all to come together. I want you to come into this room. I want you to sit down. And I want you to look at me. <laughs> and I want you all to celebrate how much more I love this person than all of you. <laughs> She's the best, you suck, you suck, you suck, and now give us presents. <laughs> give us presents or the cash equivalent. Here I made a list like a child does for Santa. 